All right, YouTubers. Today I'm working on a um, <clears throat> 2006 BMW 5 Series 550i, and uh, I keep getting a pop-up on the dash where it shows that the DSC is not working. It shows up red, and um, <clears throat> also uh, let me show you. I have a brake light on the dash. The service engine is on because it's not started, but it's not triggering the check engine light. But uh, it is triggering a little orange triangle there and the brake light orange. And it also shows up with the car leaning to one side in the red and sometimes yellow. So, doing a diagnostic and uh, yeah, I'll show you how you, you can check. I had a few code, uh, 5D, uh, 5D, 5D, 5D. And uh, if you do have a scanner, you can be able to go into your ABS DSC. And you'll go into, uh, you can read the codes and you'll, you can look it up. Or you can do a live data, uh, dynamic stability control. And I drove the car with my computer connected and I did not get any yaw rate um, sensor signal, nor did I get any transversal acceleration. It would, it would, these wasn't working, but this was working on this side. Speed sensor's working, everything is working, except for these two is no signal. So I did get a code for the yaw rate sensor, which I, uh, I'm i uh, showing you guys where it is on this 5 series. Uh, this is the 550, I'm not sure where all of them, some of them is under the driver's seat and some of them is under the passenger seat. This one here in particular was under the passenger seat. If you raise up the, the seat, you don't have to uh, take the whole seat out. You can just lean it back, take the bolts out, lean it back, and you'll be able to get under there. And there it is right here. This sensor right here. It's plugged in on the side there. This particular vehicle, the sunroof was broken. And uh, a lot of rain water came into the vehicle. So I had to wet vacuum it out. And um, and it's, uh, I think that's probably what caused the damage for the sensor. But it didn't, it don't look it don't look bad. It don't look rusted. Excuse me there, um, people. Uh, don't look rusted. The connections, they look pretty clean. Uh, trying to get a good picture for you guys. It looks pretty clean, connections. But I'm not getting any signal. There's the part here, part number. And uh, I'm going to replace this because I'm not, it's not working right now. So I'm, the first thing I'll do, I'll just try to clean up the connections and see if that'll do anything. If not, I'll just replace it. But uh, yeah, people, I just wanted to show you guys the location of the yaw rate sensor. And on this particular vehicle, it's under the passenger seat, close to the middle center console. And uh, if you guys have any questions, hit me up. I know this is a common problem with a lot of BMWs, and uh, it's not always the fix, same fix, so there is other things that to check for. Uh, this particular one here had a leaking rack of pinion, which I just changed, and I thought maybe that would cause the light to come on, but it did, it did have a really bad leak, and um, I replaced the sensor, replaced the fluid, put it back everything together and light was still there and uh new battery has a new battery alternator is working good and uh now i'm just checking all the connections on everything I tested everything so far everything is working fine the only thing that i'm not getting signal to is the yaw rate sensor so most likely that is the culprit on this guy here all right people give me a like and subscribe and uh I see you guys on the next next video.